Hey guys. Hi guys. So here we go. This is the beginning of the San Diego Comic Con slash Fugitive Toys slash everything else exclusive. All the exciting exclusives <laughs> that we're going to get. I cannot wait to open this. Most of them are in here. We still have a few that are coming in the mail, but we're going to get this thing started <laughs> off. There is some awesome stuff in this box. Uh, this is probably what I, the biggest thing that I've been yeah. waiting for. He stayed up till like 4 or 5 in the morning just to order these, so yeah, it's a really exciting thing. <laughs> uh, along with a lot of you other people out there oh, too. Yeah. <laughs> we were talking, so <laughs> we were ready. In this box is what I've been waiting for. It's from Fugitive Toys. I know you guys have been waiting to see it. Mm -hmm. We'll take it in two movies because it's going to be... Uh, we don't want to make this thing 30 minutes long. <laughs> it would so. be an extremely <laughs> long video if we put it all together. So let's open it up. I can't wait to see it. This is going to be amazing. I can feel it. Once again, Fugitive does an amazing job packaging. Oh yeah, lots of paper. They know what they're doing when it comes to packaging. <laughs> so, a whole bunch of paper out the door. Oh my god! Before I even look in here, they gave us some extra stuff. Yeah, we have some extra goodies. We have a little Marvel thing, a little keychain, which I need a keychain. This is perfect. Oh, yeah, you do. So I we'll set that aside. That. We'll uh, we'll open that this this one because <laughs> it actually will make sense with what we're about to open. Yeah. And we got a uh, another something to that effect. It's a Tokidoki. Oh, my God, that's cute. Yeah, I'm not really sure what that is, but we'll let you open that okay. one when, when the deal comes. And uh, let me take these out. My I precious. <laughs> Once again, they put them in pop protectors. I think you all know what they are. Oh my oh. god! They're beautiful! <laughs> they they're are. beautiful! Oh my god! Oh, your children! There's something else in there that's gonna be really awesome. You'll see him in a future video. <gasps> oh my god! These things are amazing! <laughs> The White Lanterns. Oh my oh, god. wow. I love them. They're so pretty. We were lucky enough to get a decent paint job. Superman's a little me, but Lantern looks perfect. It's not bad. I mean, the little curl's got a little spot, but hey, that's not wow. so bad. Wow. That is so fresh. It's that very white, sleek. That I white love is that. fresh. Oh, god, I love guys. it. Now, I've got a Batman coming as well, but he's coming from pop culture that's because true. he's going to be a Toronto or oh, uh, uh, fan Expo exclusive. exclusive. I don't know how exclusive he's actually going to be, but he's going to be at the <laughs> Toronto Fan Expo. So if you want one, they used to have them on Pop Culture, but I believe the pre-order is sold out now. Mm -hmm. But I'm sure Fugitive will have them up on their website because I believe it's going to be a Fugitive <laughs> toy exclusive as well. So, <gasps> oh my God! <laughs> I want to open him right now. This is going to look great with all the other flashes I have, but oh, yet yeah, I yeah. still don't have the original flash. What am I doing? I need the red <laughs> yeah, flash. We have all of the special flashes, but not the not the OG. So the OG. Get we need that the OG. One. New 52 and OG. <gasps> Man, guys. I I don't know what to say. This thing is beautiful. I'm super excited. Let me see Flash. Oh my god! He's so pretty! So one thing that's <laughs> awesome about Fugitive, all their exclusive, their collectibles, they put them in yes. uh, pop protectors. At least they have the last few times when we got the blue mm -hmm. Flash, which you can see him back here. When we got him from Fugitive, they sent us it in a, a pop protector, yeah, which so is a great idea. It's, it's cheap worth the so. little extra money that you're going to pay for these. Yeah, if you're gonna, these things used to be like $14, but now we're paying upwards of $18, so it's uh -huh. awesome that they throw the pop protector in them because that only helps them too because right. this thing will get smashed I wonder if that's much. why they raised the prices up a little bit is so that they could put the pop protectors on them, which I'm okay with that, totally especially okay with that. shipping. Mm -hmm. You never know how the post office is going to deliver stuff. It just saves me shipping anyways to have to buy these pop protectors. Yeah. So let's take it out of the box and... Finally! Man, that is so beautiful. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. It's so pretty! Look at this! That is so, it's so cool. It's so smooth! There's not one bad spot on him! So the perfect. the silver on these guys are they're it's actually a shining silver. Yeah, it's, it's got metallic. flakes. It's got flakes. It's not just a regular gray or silver. It's got some flake in it, like yeah, you said. His boots are metallic. Even mm -hmm. the the um, ropes on his arm, I don't know what they're called, but they're metallic too. Little I flashes on yeah. the Whew, guys, it's so beautiful. Is this your holy grail piece of this Comic Con? And you know, definitely. And These are the ones I wanted the most. Now, I'm obviously waiting for Batman because that's my <laughs> biggest. Uh, well, that's obviously I'm the biggest fan of Batman, and I can't uh -huh. wait for Batman. Batman looks awesome, guys. <laughs> Batman does. looks maybe the coolest out of all of these. But look at those guys. Now, <laughs> I'll tell you what, this white flash, he might be cooler than the blue flash. Oh, I think he's much cooler than the blue flash. He's I'm just so clean. glad we got he's him. He's so clean. He's the, fresh. The only thing on here is it looks like the stripes on his arms were freehand. Yeah, there's some there's some crazy things going on in the paint. 
that's a little meh, yeah. but it's not a huge deal because... No, because he still looks super cool. Yeah, he still, <laughs> he looks most really of it still looks good. Woo! I love him! Oh my god. I just want to like keep these out of the box and pose them and they're just really cute. I think we've made <laughs> our viewers jealous enough. You want to see these things up close. Let's do that now. Yeah. Okay guys, so here they are up close. They are so awesome. They are so pretty and for as simple of a paint job they have, there's so much detail packed into the simplicity of these. They're just, they're super gorgeous. Very much so. Now, one thing that kind of bothers me just because I'm kind of strange, I guess, about this <laughs> kind of thing. The fact that Superman's boots are not the same silver that Flash's are. I honestly think that they should have matched oh, yeah. that metallic paint of his boots to Superman's boots and to his gloves to Superman. Yeah, you know, that's kind of strange to me why they wouldn't do that. Yeah, the silver on Superman's cape doesn't even match the boots and gloves. I'm wondering if that's not a mistake that we got or what the deal is because that's really know. weird that they would do that. Yeah. That really should match. It's kind of off-putting being that it's so flat and everything else on Superman is shiny. Yeah, if you guys got these, is your Superman the same? Does he have flat matte color on his boots and gloves or is it metallic? Yeah, so that's weird. I'm not a big, I'm not too happy about that to be honest with you. That kind of, it's kind yeah, of strange. Yeah, it kind of makes it meh, not so great, but he's still cool. But still really, really yeah. cool. I can actually paint that. That's not a big Yeah, we can doctor it and fix it. <laughs> but these things are great, guys. I'm a huge fan of this. I don't really know what to say about it because you can really see how great it is. It's very clean, it's very fresh, it's very white. <laughs> it's very, very pretty, and I love the like lightning bolts on Flash's shoes, how they stick off, and same thing on his head. I mean, that's similar to the other Flashes, but I, that's my favorite thing about him. I just love that detail. And they're gonna look so great as a set. This is the first time we actually get a variant set that is yeah. a full set where you get more than one. Huge fan of it. Let's take a look at this thing up close. Let's check out Superman first. So here is Superman up close and personal. He looks really awesome. Once again, the goods on this thing, obviously the white paint job is so clean. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. He looks really fresh. I love the huge logo on his chest. The I huge white lantern Superman logo. That really pops out compared to what you usually see on Superman's chest where it's a little smaller uh -huh. and not so prevalent. That thing really sticks out and looks awesome. It even kind of sets itself off of his chest just because of the way that they painted it. It looks like it even comes off the chest and I'm a huge fan of that. I'm a big fan of it. I love how detailed it is and it just is the focal point. It draws your eyes into that instead of the rest of his body so I love it. Now as we take a look at his back, you notice that his cape is super shiny. Once again, huge fan of it. Definitely. Weird maybe that it doesn't have the Superman logo on the back of it. I can't remember if in White Lantern he has a logo on his cape, but I would assume that he does. So maybe that could have been on there. Overall, this guy's really cool. The goods, beautiful paint job. Mm -hmm. Great idea to, to bring in these White Lantern sets. Love the shiny silver. I agree. The hair is a little shiny. That means that could probably be a little more dull. And uh, we're not really sure what's going on with the gloves and the boots. Are they actually supposed to be shiny? Let us know in the comments if you bought this. Is this thing actually supposed to be metallic like the rest of his, uh, his body? Okay, so really to get a feeling for how cool this Flash is, <laughs> we really need to take a look at all of the variant of Flashes that we have so far and to really get an idea of how cool this white one looks, not only as a pop itself, but with the whole set. I mean, what can I say? It's great. <laughs> I mean, it's so fresh and clean like we were saying. So, Fugitive actually picks up a lot of these Flash exclusives. They yeah. started with the Black Flash, which is probably my favorite Flash, just based off of the fact that it looks really cool. I love the black, I love the, the, the crazy mouth, and uh, obviously the color looks really cool being black and sleek. The Reverse Flash is a, it was a Dallas Comic Con exclusive. A lot of times you can find it on Toy Matrix. Yeah, they that's had, true. They had, it's called the, the Reverse Flash. They also had a Glow Reverse Flash, which is a lot harder to find where it was glow in the dark. And I believe it was a yellow glow in the dark. So in that case, it makes sense. It oh really yeah, cool. definitely. That'd have been really cool. The, the Blue Lantern Flash we just got not too long ago. Yeah. Three or four months ago, maybe, tops. And that guy looks really cool too. If you don't know mm -hmm. him, he's a must have as well. Oh, I agree. So now we're here at the White Lantern Flash, another Fugitive Toys exclusive, mm -hmm. obviously. And it looks really, really awesome. Now, one thing that's interesting, we started off with the regular DC Universe on the top of these boxes, and then they moved into that new DC Comics kind of uh, <laughs> set. 
But now yeah. we're at something called DC Comics Superheroes. So I don't know what's going on with the way they're they're, they're changing the logo. Things, but hey, you know it's cool. You kind of get a feeling for how great they are. Overall, this Flash is beautiful. The everything's silver, uh -huh. everything's shiny. I agree. There really isn't anything bad that I can think of of this Flash. The only thing bad that I can see on this Flash is obviously the lightning things on his wrist that are hand painted some of them I like everything to be completely asymmetrical and they're not on his wrist yeah the, but the bolts around his arms aren't painted that well I would assume that's pretty difficult to do they're not so horrible that it totally no yeah it's it, not like oh my god but however it is pretty weird and messed up uh-huh yeah. but he's still gorgeous I love him flash is one of my favorite superheroes so I think this is super great and I just I love it. I hope Fugitive, Fugitive keeps up with all of these exclusives and variants because it seems like it's Fugitive's kind of baby. They have all of the variants, so, yeah, so keep it up. Keep an eye on this guy. You gotta get him if you're a DC fan. Keep I agree. an eye on these paint jobs. Some of them are a little strange. And I really want to know about Superman. Is he actually supposed to be metallic? <laughs> I'm gonna have to look him up later today online to see what's going on with that because if they did elect to paint him flat gray like that, I just don't understand that. And I'm probably gonna have to fix that because it kind of bothers me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know it's strange, so. Okay, there they are. Oh my god. They're they are so gorgeous. I'm super jealous that we have these and that they're going on your shelf. I want them on my side. More <laughs> DC these. to add to my collection because I love the DC <laughs> and keep these variants coming because they don't get old for me anyways. No, not at all. Any <laughs> variant that comes out we will definitely <laughs> buy. As far as the main DC guys yeah. go. Yeah, Superman, now, Batman, all that. We want an Arrow. Yes, I need Arrow. I don't want him. I need him. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. We need an Arrow. We need more Arrows. Yes. Uh, also, also, let's get some villains going because yeah, I, I want more villains. There's a I lot of villains them. that we need to get more variants of, especially in the Lantern series. We need some Red Lanterns. That'd be really cool. Oh yeah, we do. So, love it, guys. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is going to end up being like the Blue Flash and the Black Flash, as far mm -hmm. as that goes with Fugitive Toys. They're going to end up showing up on their website every once in a while, where they'll get two or three of them at a time. Yeah. And you just kind of got to check the website <laughs> and order it as at will. Now, we didn't get the glow-in-the-dark ones, obviously, because you know we're not a huge fan of the glow-in-the-dark. No. I just don't see it being that worthwhile of the extra money. Because mm -mm. really, I just I think they're great as yeah. they are. I think and this Flash would have been pretty cool in glow-in-the-dark, but it wasn't a necessity for us to have him in glow-in-the-dark. Yeah. I like him as is. So. Yeah, so, but they do also come in glow-in-the-dark, <laughs> so I don't know. Those will probably be a little more rare than the regular ones will. Yeah. But as long as you check their website every once in a while, you might get lucky and find one. Yeah, you might. You know, you never know. I don't think they'll put more glow-in-the-dark up, but they might put just regular. Yeah, usually it's just the regular that they, they throw up. So. <laughs> so we also got these things from Fugitive. These are like the extra things that came in the box. Yeah. I got a Marvel Money World kind of thing going on. I don't know. It's from Kid Robot. I know the money is where you can kind of make them yourself. But it's got some cool stuff. It's got Magneto, Thanos, Wolverine, Silver Surfer, Carnage. Ooh, and Silver then, Surfer's in Yeah, it's got some cool stuff. Punisher, what? Scarlet Spider, Hulk, Cyclops, and War Machine. If I was going to pick one that I want, ooh, it probably had to end up being Magneto, Wolverine, or maybe Cyclops. I want Silver Surfer. Punisher looks pretty Punisher's cool, too. Punisher's cool, too. Yeah. All right, open yours. Let's you open it and see what I got. Hopefully, it'll be something cool. I think it's a keychain. I need a keychain. It might be a zipper, though. I think it's a zipper in. That's oh, I is. bet it is a zipper thing. Yeah. yeah. I don't need that. I'm not no. putting anything in my zipper. Maybe, Maybe I can put my book bag. Maybe put it in your book bag. Who is it? Who is it? As the great Johnny Carson once went. Whoa! <laughs> okay, they're a lot smaller than I thought they were. <laughs> I flew out of that. <laughs> so we got a Scarlet Spider. He's really, really <laughs> tiny. And, uh, me? It's alright. It's cool. It's free. <laughs> I'll take it. So he's got a little clip thing on it where you can just kind of snap it onto whatever you want, whether it be a zipper or heck, you can put on a necklace if you wanted, I suppose. Yeah, or a charm bracelet. Something yeah, a charm like bracelet. That. But they're really <laughs> tiny, but they're cool. They're so cool. They're cute. Thanks, Fugitive. Thank you. And then we also got this. I don't even. I don't know what that is. A Toki Toki Doki. Toki Doki. I don't really know what it does or what it's for. It's a phone. It's a phone clip. Oh, it's thing? probably a, a, like I don't one know. of the, the cell phone gems or whatever you know. That or it's one of those things that goes into your charger. So let's open it and see what we mm, got. That's possible. It's very small. It's green. I can't get this out of here. It's in some sort of packaging. Ah! Oh my gosh. Wonder why they do that. Is it like soft? It's like a cactus. I can't get this out of here. Oh my god, that's it cute! It does. It goes into your phone jack. That's neat. I like it. Oh, so it's you got a cactus, puppy dog. A, a cactus yeah. puppy dog. 
It's a cat or a dog as a cactus. I don't know, but it's cute. I like it. Yeah, that's actually kind of cool. It just plugs right into your, yeah. your audio jack, into your cell phone. I'm going to put that on my phone. I like that. <laughs> that's cool. A little so cactus. Cute. Cactus dog. <laughs> so there you have it, guys. Aren't they beautiful? They are gorgeous. I want them. <laughs> I'm in love. These two are super awesome. If you were lucky enough to get them, I am so excited for you. If you didn't get them, you still have a chance. You know, the eBay keep vouchers trying. probably have some. I don't mm -hmm. know that, but keep checking the website. I'm sure they're going to have some more here. Fugitive soon. will have them. Fugitive more than will likely. have them. They're not going to be extremely <laughs> rare. They're just going to only come out once a month, maybe a few mm -hmm. of them. So you just yeah. got to keep on it and keep trying. And uh, they are beautiful and well worth the cost. <laughs> they are. They're asking because <laughs> these are some of the best. Obviously, if you're a DC fan, some of the best variants that they've come out with because I they agree. are clean, they are fresh, they are sexy, <laughs> and they are going to look beautiful on our shelf. They will. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.